Hey guys, so today I wanted to give you an updated tour of my apartment in Anyang, South Korea. This apartment is located around Pyeongchang Station. This is a really great neighborhood to live in. There are so many parks in this neighborhood. It's a great area if you have dogs and kids. We also have a really beautiful stream that's great for riding bikes. Around Pyeongchang Station, you can find many restaurants to eat at and also a lot of cafes. You can also access Emart through the station. You can just take exit 2 and it'll take you to the side entrance of Emart. Alright, so let's get started with my updated apartment tour. As you enter the apartment, we have a safety gate to keep our dogs from running out the door. On the left side, we keep a coat rack, but my husband pretty much just uses it as his closet. He likes to throw everything on there. On the right side, we have this very tall shoe closet. It has enough space to hold all of our shoes. At the bottom of the shoe closet, I took out one of the shelves and I put some recycling bags under here. So it's just a great place to hide my recyclables. And in the middle, I just put all of our shopping bags in here. And then our bigger shopping bags are on the middle shelf. As we walk in, we have the kitchen right next to the entrance. Our sink was actually leaking when we came to look at the apartment, but the landlady promised to fix that for us. I was also surprised because she put in new kitchen cabinets, so I just felt really grateful that all of that stuff was new. Here we have our stove and built-in oven. The oven is really great. It is a gas oven, so it cooks everything so well. Underneath the stove, I keep all of our extra seasonings and cooking oils and sauces in here. I really like this pull-out cart. It just makes it easier to look for things when I'm cooking. Here we have our small sink and some area where we can prepare our food. Like I mentioned in the last video, I really dislike these countertops. It's very hard to keep them dry, so I have to keep towels on top of them to absorb all of the water. Next to our refrigerator, I bought this kitchen shelf on Coupon and it is very handy. It fits all of our appliances and it can also store some items at the bottom. Between the shelf and refrigerator, we had some extra space. So I found these pull-out carts on Coupon. They come in very handy and they can hold a lot of stuff. I put this rack on the side of our refrigerator and it's perfect for holding our paper towels and bags. On the left side, we have a small room. And the reason why we don't use this as our bedroom is because if we put a bed in here, it would literally take up the entire room. So we just decided to use this as our closet and we also made it into our dog's bedroom. I just made a fence with their old doggy playpen and I can just open and close it. So whenever we go out, I can just lock it up and know that my dogs are safe in their room. When we pull back the curtains, we have our closet in here. I got these closet pulls off of Coupon and they fit perfectly into this room. I also moved the shelf to the right side and I just put my t-shirts and towels and extra clothes on this shelf. And I have baskets up there to hold all of my little stuff. These drawers I also got on Coupon, pretty much everything I got on Coupon. So if you guys are interested, I will link all of my stuff down below. But here are also my dogs' tents and beds and their potty as well. My dogs love to come and sleep in their tents when they are tired. So I also made this bigger section with their old playpen. It just has more room for them if they want to go hang out in there. And yep, they just sleep in their tents all day. In the middle, we have our bathroom. Our bathroom doesn't have a separate shower area. So when we take a shower, the whole bathroom gets wet. I don't mind everything getting wet because I like to clean the bathroom as well while I'm taking a shower. It just saves me time. 
when we were apartment hunting as soon as i saw this bathroom i wanted to get the apartment i just love the colors of the tiles and everything looked really nice and new so this room is our main room we use it as our bedroom our office our living room and this is where we spend most of our time the room size is perfect for me and my husband and our three dogs but i do wish we had a little bit more room for the dogs to be able to run around and play as you can tell i love the color white so most of the stuff in our room is white i got the desk from coupon and the middle drawer we got from ikea and then i think my bookshelves i got those on g market our floor mats are the same star ones that were in my previous video i just flipped them over because on the other side my dogs chewed them so much so i just wanted to cover all of that let me show you guys how my room looks like with the curtains open we usually get a good amount of sunlight and then we also have our terrace right there where we can see outside and be able to do our laundry and hang dry our clothes there in this corner i actually made my online classroom i teach with vip kit online so i just chose this corner to put my backdrop and to use as my classroom i wanted a little bit more privacy when i was teaching so i just bought three boards from the stationery store and made a little partition this also helps to just hide all of my backdrop and teaching materials so it's really great to have since i teach mostly at night time when my husband is home this also helps to just block out everything so i can focus more in my classes on this side we have our sofa and our bed and this sofa actually pulls out so it can become a bed sometimes i pull it out during the day just to hang out with my dogs and lie around and over here we have our bookshelves and all of our books and just miscellaneous stuff most of these books i have not read i don't know why i always buy books and then i never read them and they're just sitting there for years we will actually only be living here a few more months we have a new apartment that we will be moving to so i will show you guys our new apartment when we move our final room is the terrace room and to go in here we have to step down we just keep our extra chairs in here and our dirty clothes our washing machine is also here and up here is a drying rack where we can hang our clothes to dry there is also a storage closet on the left side so we like to keep all of our suitcases and just extra items in there all right everyone that is my updated apartment tour in Anyang, south korea if you guys are looking for a quieter neighborhood and less busy than seoul i really recommend pyeongchang station and bumgay station i'm someone that definitely needs parks around because i love riding my bike and also i have three dogs so i need some place where they can run around and go on long walks if you guys have any questions about my apartment or living in Anyang, just leave a comment down below and i'll get back to you thank you guys for watching don't forget to like and subscribe see you next time bye bye